Okay, I'm Edie, and my mother-in-law is laying down, taking a nap. Um, of my hind on my collaboration with Judy Lee, of Judy Lee, as well as uh, Victoria Collier of the Victorian Edge, which I keep forgetting to link below. Ah! But anyway, um, yeah, this... Don't ask me what week this is. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe nine, I think. Um, and I think this is the last thing I have to make before I start gathering my materials. I think. I hope. <laughs> For the uh, journal. And then, of course, I'll be giving it away. Okay, this one is supposed to be clusters. Um, clusters can be made of anything, and it's just whatever you find to put on it. It could be a scrap piece of material, you know, a little bitty piece that you were going to throw away. Hey, put it on the cluster. Uh, sticker. And who doesn't have stickers? I went to Hobby Lobby again yesterday. I have more stickers. Okay. Um, little doodads that I've ordered from AliExpress, uh, paper, 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 you name the place, I've been there for paper, <laughs> almost, um, if it's in my area that I know about. Okay, and then also online, sitting here thinking, do I want to order some more stuff from Joann's? Will I ever really move? If I do, I'm going to have to have an unloading sale. <laughs> I don't have to have it until I do, though. Okay. Uh, why am I saying if I move? My family is from Texas. You know, they're all in Texas except one sister. Uh, her and her husband, they live in a fifth wheel, and they are the modern-day nomads, and they uh, like to go different places, but then they have their... Uh, winter spot where they go uh, and then after a bit they're on the road again well they're not there all winter but anyway they're in, they're some uh, so they're in Texas some but they're on the roads and one of these days I want a tiny house but I'll have a she shed to go along with my tiny house <laughs> keep the tiny house where it's all neat, neat and straight. And then when I want to craft, go out to my she shed. Might as well have a bed out in my she shed. <laughs> Cause that's where I want to stay all the time. All right. But anyway, to show you a few clusters I've made, here's one, this one's got a ribbon. This has got a piece of, um, kind of like burlap. Where is that big old piece? Now that I'm thinking about it, I won't be able to find... Oh, here it is. I don't know where I got it. Maybe Miss Judy gave it to me. But I cut off a piece of it. And yes, I have scrap uh, fabric, but I left it at home. Okay, and a sticker. Decorative paper and cardstock. And a button. Just doesn't have to make any sense. Just put it on there. Of course, I still have to think. Okay, this one... Maybe they might call it a tag because I didn't put, but uh, decorative paper, cardstock, a little uh, kitty cat. I think I got this off of AliExpress. And a little word. What does it say? Sweet. <laughs> but I'm going to call it a cluster. All right. Let me see if that. Well, I kind of need the light. I hope it's okay for y'all. Oops, do I have it? No, okay, I got it right. Okay, a piece of, that's not washi, it's cardstock. A little phrase, happiness. Now, this is a piece of material, scrap piece of material behind it. Cardstock here. A little punch out there. And then another punch out behind it, or else it's just a, a sticker. I can't remember which one. Okay. And I've got this cardstock, this, 
and, and there's some uh, material right there. And that's a cluster. You just, you're supposed to just use up your scraps however you can. Okay. Uh, here's one cardstock, scrap piece of paper, scrap piece of paper, button, button. Who's got the button? Lace. And a word. What does the word say? Dance. Okay. Now you could also make this a cluster tag. <laughs> okay, you can put it on a card, you can put it inside a journal, you can make it a pocket, whatever you want to do. Okay. And then here's one. A button from AliExpress. Uh, I believe this lace here is from, or ribbon, is from uh, Dollar Tree stickers uh, of a stamp, piece of material behind it, purple and green material, dark green cardstock, and the word together. Okay. Do I have anything? Oh, one more. Four elements. I'm trying to see, is that four? Oh, okay. I layered some punched out butterflies and made it dimensional. Just layered one on top of the other. Okay, this is a little button from AliExpress. A word sticker, awesome, and just cardstock. Okay, just using up whatever you have. So, I'm supposed to show you how to make these things. Only thing is I can't show you down because I don't have the equipment for doing it. But I'm gonna show you what I've pulled. This. Maybe you don't recognize it, but it's from a Kleenex box. Uh, what brand? Scotty's? Well, I say a Kleenex box, a tissue box. Kleenex is a brand. This is from Scotty's, okay, and I cut out this. Then I had a piece of this material, uh, not material, um, decorative paper. Right now I don't have something hard behind it, but when I finish it, I'm going to put something behind it to give it more firmness. Right now, I don't have it, so I'm not going to worry about it. But, I'm thinking I'm going to do it like that. And then you see how that's not quite even. So, I got a little purple heart. We can blend that in. And since you know what I'm doing, I'm going to be gluing it. I'm going to go and glue it real quick. Now, my glue, this tip part, hasn't worked for me. I've got a bobby, not bobby pin, what do you call these? Safety pins. See if I can poke a hole. The glue will dry from time to time. Okay, maybe that'll work, I hope. All right, let's see. Please work. Please, please. Yes, okay, it's working. It's amazing what putting a hole in something will do. <laughs> okay. So all I've done is put some glue down. Uh, I think I'll turn it this way. Just lay it down as what I think is straight. Ah! Okay. Oops, y'all see the glue I got on the table. <laughs> and it's not straight, I can tell, from the back of it. But in the end, it's not going to be seen. And I will need to put uh, a backing because this is too thin. But since I didn't pull it yet, I'll do it afterwards. Okay, now I'm going to lay the heart down. Just put some glue on here. Don't need a whole bunch. Boy, this glue gets sticky on your fingers. Oops. There we go. So now what I'm going to do. Well, I did cut a piece of burlap so I can technically say I used the piece of material. Uh, why not? I've heard people say, don't think about it, just do it. 
Okay, I, I will admit, I kind of thought about it before I started this video. didn't exactly know where I was going to put this, but I did have my materials out. And I do have other materials out, too. Ooh, yeah, that's going to need a backing on it. Okay. But I've laid the material. Just grabbing something. Don't want to put that on top of there. Don't want to put it over here. That's just a tiny envelope. Does it make any sense to have it on there? I don't know. Uh, I have a pink butterfly I thought about putting on there. Let's put it, but what am I gonna put over here? I don't know. That's too big. <laughs> the fan and the colors are red instead of pink. It really don't matter. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put the butterfly real quick. And yes, glue is sticking on my fingers. Ah! Somebody said something about um, baby powder. So after this dries, I think I'm going to put some baby powder and see if it doesn't help with the sticky. I hope the baby powder comes off. Has anybody heard of that? Because, you know, it takes forever for this sticky if it ever goes away. Oops, my butterfly ain't sticking. Them. Maybe I need the Fabri-Tac. I don't have Fabri-Tac. <sighs> Come on, glue. This may not work right there. My glue's not coming out very good. Well, when all else fails, try the other end. <laughs> the other end did work today, but it kind of put out a lot. Oops, yep, it's putting out a lot again. It does a lot. Oh yeah, talk about sticky. Okay, I'm pressing it down. Y'all, I'm going to wash my hands real quick. This is really sticky. Okay, coming back. I couldn't ask mother-in-law to entertain you because she's laying down. Now, okay, it's, come off, come off, come off. There's where I stuck the butterfly. The heart, in my opinion, needs something. I have a white button. I'll put the big old fan, which doesn't have any pink in it. Put that pink button. No, I don't like the pink button. Yes, you're not supposed to think about it, but let's be for real. Who of us doesn't think about it? If any of y'all don't think about it, let me know. <laughs> I have to think about it. I go, does this look good? Does that look good? I don't know. Okay, I'm going to try something else. I got more little button, button, buttons. Okay, I have a pink button, and I'm going to try to add this. I don't have Gorilla Glue with me. I don't know if this multi-purpose glue is going to work. I'm going to try it. I'm just trying to stick this button down. I probably need Gorilla Glue. But when you don't have it, you do with what you got. Now, right now it's holding, but I don't know what's going to happen when it dries. <laughs> Can we worry about that later? Okay. Then we're going to put a splotch of glue right there, and it sounded like a splotch. Okay. I'm going to put this pink button in the middle of that. i got to hold it for a minute. Hopefully, you look the glue will catch. Now if you wanted to, you could put a, a paper clip behind it, like a hidden paper clip, uh, a cluster hidden paper clip. Why not? And, oops. Okay, I'm trying to pick this up. All right, I'm gonna let that be it. <laughs> it's 
toe clusters or whatever you make them out to be use up pretty uh, when you have a box that's pretty and you're going to throw the box away from a tissue or whatever cut off a piece of it and use in it uh, if you have scrap material or something you have no idea what you're going to do cut a piece off use it in there decorative paper I will be putting a backing on here okay and I just did a punch added a button and glued a little ladybug button on top of it so it's whatever you want to make it out to be I have thought about using these these empty tea bags but it's orange and right now I don't have, oh yeah I do have an orange flower <laughs> okay now if I were going to sell this uh, something I wouldn't use this because this brand and everything else they might get upset about that okay but as far as just giving something away you know I don't think there's any problem with that but that would be orange that would be cute and then what could you put in it I don't know you do have to uh, kind of get out the dry tea that's in there I mean it's a tea bag but some of the tea still gets out so I kind of had to wipe it out and I still feel some so I'd have to wipe it out even better but it's just dried tea but some people might be picky about that okay well that's my take on making clusters bye y'all what's sticking to me oh buddy <laughs>